Yo, what's going on my BVOGs, my Omi homies, my Marvel Mighties collectors, and everybody else on YouTube, it's your bromi, the Gale, back at it again with another BV Drop Strategy video. Come on! Okay, so you know what time it is, we got another drop on Saturday, this time it's another Marvel Mighties drop, and it's the Eternals, which is an interesting uh, drop because the movie is like out in theaters right now. So this is going to be a very cool drop to um, to get, but we're going to get into that. So in this video, I'm going to give you guys the drop details and my thoughts on this drop, and then we're going to call it a day. So without further ado, let's breeze into it. Marvel Mighties Series 4, Eternals. The next Marvel Mighties series drops on Saturday, November 6th at 8 a.m. PT, only on the VV app for iOS and Android, Eternals. Sent to Earth by the Celestials centuries ago to protect humankind from a race of predators called the Deviants. The Eternals arrive in the MCU in Marvel Studios' Eternals. With unique abilities derived from a cosmic power source, the Eternals are forced out of the shadows and must find each other once again after their most ancient enemy reappears and threatens life as they know it. Available globally. First up is Cersei, the Eternal with an affinity for humanity. Cersei has the ability to manipulate matter and change the makeup of any non-sentient material that she touches. So, she's going to cost $13 as will every run as will every box since it's blind boxed. She's going to have 18,000 editions, first appearance, rarity, common, license, Marvel brand, Marvel Mighties series, series 4 Eternals available globally. Icarus is the leader of the Eternals boasts the power of incredible strength, flight, and the ability to project beams of intense cosmic energy from his eyes. So he is also a common with 18,000 additions. Kingo, a famous Bollywood star who must leave his life of celebrity and wealth to reunite with his fellow Eternals. Kingo uses his power to project cosmic energy projectiles from his hands to repel the new deviant threat. So Kingo is also a common with 18,000 additions. Fastos, Possessing the power of invention, Fastos has helped nudge humanity forward technologically over the centuries as he is able to create whatever he can imagine provided he has enough raw materials at his disposal. So Fastos is also a common with 18,000 additions. Makari, the fastest woman in the universe. Makari uses her cosmically powered super speed to scout planets for the Eternals as well as protect humanity as she is the only deaf Eternal the sonic boom that comes with her cosmic running does not affect her. So she is the first uncommon with 9,000 additions. Makari. Druig. Aloof and powerful, at times hard to determine whether he is friend or foe, Druig can use cosmic energy to control the minds of men. So he is also a common with 9,000 additions. Sprite. With the ability to cast lifelike illusions, Sprite is much stronger and cleverer than she appears, which is as a 13-year-old girl. So she is our first rare with 6,000 additions. Ajak can heal humans and Eternals and possesses the ability to communicate with Celestials. She is the spiritual leader of the Eternals and her wisdom has helped guide the team since they arrived from their home planet to help defend humanity. So she is also a rare with 6,000 additions. Gilgamesh, the strongest and kindest Eternal who is capable of projecting a powerful exoskeleton of cosmic energy. Gilgamesh is a fierce warrior who has become legendary for his fights with the Deviants throughout history. So Gilgamesh is our first ultra rare with 3,500 additions. More comfortable in battle than any other place. Thana has the ability to use cosmic energy to form any handheld weapon she can think of. So she is our last ultra rare for this drop with 3,500 additions. So now let's get into the thoughts and strategy portion of the video. Okay, so for my thoughts and strategies, uh, I will be participating in this uh, drop. I, I, I am a fan, a big fan of the Marvel Mighties. I think they are heavily slept on across every series. Um, I have every I have every set up to date, and I plan on having this set. Hopefully, I can get both ultra rares. I know that's a I know that's a, a tall ask, but um, I will have this set eventually. 
these Marvel Mighties just looks like sleep looks like a sleeper to me. Like um, I think some of these might be animated, if I'm not mistaken. But um, you know, you gotta be forward thinking when it comes to Vivi. Like they these look like they can be in a kid's show, in a TV show one day, or in a video game in the Vivi verse. Like each one of these looks like they might have a special ability, which they already do in the movie. Um, and which brings me to my next point. It's now in theaters. So it's uh, it's more than obvious right now that Marvel is using Vivi to advertise and to promote uh, current happenings in the MCU, the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, this is very awesome for investors in the Omi token and in Vivi collectibles. You know, Vivi is officially in bed with Marvel. You know, they are using each other in a perfectly symbiotic relationship and it is going quite well so uh there's not too much strategy actual strategy with these since it's blind boxed you know be be there on time make sure you're uh you know you got your wi-fi and your co good connection and make sure you got your family members or whoever else is helping you out stuff like that i made a video uh called gale gate where i have a technique for these blind box drops where whether you miss or get the first attempt you can you can, you can get a pretty good chance at getting a rebound if you do my specific technique. So you can watch that video. It should be like two videos down or two videos ago. So, um, but yeah, more on the Eternals. I am not familiar with these characters. I, you know, only comic fans will probably know about these guys since they've never really been on, on the big screen. So, um, you know, at, at any rate, I still want to have them. Because, like I said, you got to think forward when it comes to Ikomi and Vivi. I am pretty sure that these got characters are going to be... I don't know. I feel like they're going to be in a game or in a TV show or both. Um, you know, I don't... I don't know. These are, these are just really cool to have. And, oh, when it comes to Master Collector, this set is going to give you the most points daily. Because uh, it's like it has five or more characters. So you're going to be getting six points for these, uh, for this set, plus the bonuses for having the ultra rare. And if you manage to get a low mint, you'll get that low mint bonus. So this is going to be good for the master collector program. And, um, this is going to be an interesting drop because, you know, we got Disney right around the corner. People were speculating that we was going to, we were going to get the first Disney drop on Sunday, which has not been confirmed yet. So whether it's Sunday or not, people are... There's a currently a gem squeeze going on, meaning people are trying to save gems and they are selling their collectibles, you know, sometimes even at a loss to get gems. So whether people are going to, I mean, these are going to sell out. I'm pretty sure these are going to sell out, but uh, this might be a first chance for us to possibly get a uh, one to two on the drop since there's so many commons. And uh, I had a theory while I was making this video, maybe, maybe VV or Ikomi is making so many common editions because if you remember in the Master Collector Program article, we are going to be able to burn some of these collectibles. So um, I think a, a possible reason for allowing us to burn collectibles uh, might be to like earn some kind of tickets to participate in future drops. I know NBA Top Shots is doing that. Like You can burn your moments to get something called uh, tickets. And those tickets are going to give you like a access to like future drops or something like that. So that that could be one reason for why Komi has made so many. Um, or it could just be the number of users on the app. That's just a theory of mine. But at any rate, uh, I think this is a cool drop to have. You know, I'm not telling you what to do, but I'm definitely going to go for it. You know, I'm a fan of the Marvel Mighties, and I want to be a Marvel Mighties Master Collector. I've said it in the past that. There's going to be subcategories of master collectors, I think. We have so many Spider-Man Spider -Man on the app, so many Batman on the app. I think there's going to be subcategories. Like, you might not be the ultimate master collector, but you might be a master collector of Tokidoki or, you know, Spider-Man, Batman, Marvel Mighty. So, you know, you really got to pick and choose how you want to play the game. There's going to be so many ways to play, so many, so many ways to collect, so many reasons to collect. You know, there's no wrong way to do this. You know, just find your... Find your way and do it. So I don't think I have too many more, uh, too much more to say about this. You know, just you know, I don't know. 
If you want to participate, do it. If not, pass on it. Like I said, there's no wrong way to do this. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it. And that's the video, my friends. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. And if you liked or learned something from the video, feel free to drop a like on the video and consider subscribing if you want more content like this. So we're getting Marvel drops weekly. It won't be long until we're getting Disney drops weekly. Um, yeah, this train is moving almost at full speed. We're picking up steam right now, but it's chugging along. And uh, I hope you got your ticket because once it starts, it's not going to stop. So uh, yeah, with all that being said, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just your friendly neighborhood genius sharing his thoughts and opinions on this most spectacular app known as VV. So take everything that I say with a grain of salt because things could change. So with that being said, thanks again for watching and I will catch you guys in my next video. Until then, peace out and hodl strong my friends. Later.